ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another video. Now, today, what we shall be doing is with our pieces of rebar, we are going to be making a snake hook. Well, just a hook with a snake head on it. What we are making it for this. Now, as you can see, what he's done is one of these threads were a little bit wafty, so he basically cut it off and made a new thread. This is the new thread he made. You can see he welded on there. With a bit of discoloration. And he's also, there's the old one. And he's also taken that little bit out of there. You can see where he's welded and welded a new threading piece inside as well. So, pretty sort of a mega decker, aren't they? Also, upsetting block. Basically, what you do is you put it in the vise. You have your piece of rebar, such as stick it in there, whatever end up, beat on it, and then it should hopefully make that bit thicker but by beating down on it. So it's pretty much a smaller but thick piece, which we shall need in making this snake. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoy. Nice and tight. Right, we're just going to have to set that a little bit more. And then we should go and take to the back of the head. Flatten it out a little bit and then try and upset just a little bit more. That's a bit better. Better thicken it up. Well, it's now with all the gas we've got left, run out of gas. We are going to try and um, what should we call it? This make it just like I said. That's me. Right. Do it. Right, so we're just going to round this off a little bit. Gonna bring. Nose, snap it down. There you go, it's coming on. Long. We're just going to bring that down a little bit more. We're going to spread that bit out to make the snakes heads. I should just bring this down a little bit more. The dull tape really, a bit of a dull point. There, right, we're just going to... And now there you go, you've got a snake's head looking quite nice. I'll do this in the top, but just there. Right, so now what we're going to do is we're just going to bring down that snake's neck quite a long way so it's going to be like a longer taper along here. Right, so we're just going to grab this here. Just going to tape it 
down this neck. Again, bring that tape back down a little bit. Bring this back down just a little more. piece there. We're going to bring that down a little bit more than centre punch the eyes in so you've got the snake's head there. Just going to bring this down a little bit more. Relatively clear difference between the neck and the rest of the body because it's a little bit thinner. So now you're going to get a center punch, a center punch, just because you've got this diamond shape, it's just around where the points are there. So you've got a nice wide part there, so it's not too, it's not too cartoony, if you know what I mean. So it's not really correct. Um, so we've got the sense post eyes in. Um, so now what I might try and do is just gently tap in these corners here, just to well, smooth that out a little bit, and then we shall get on to the body. Right. So just be careful of those eyes, just gonna gently And that's probably about as much as we're going to do, just to smoothen those edges off there. Give it a quick little brush off. Yeah. Right, now, so get to manipulating and bend the, bending the body in all different kinds of shapes. Looking a bit snaky, for the sense of itself. Put my piece of the side part. So we're going to stick it back in the forge and just do the rest of it here. A little bit cold, so we're going to heat it up again. Uh, I think we're done on the head bit for now. We're just going to do this part here. We're only going to go for the one hole because uh, you don't have enough left for both. And I'm just going to taper this down just so it looks more like a snake. <laughs> <laughs> Just bend this one. So 
so we're just going to make that hole this bit here a bit smaller so it actually holds a screw <laughs> and we should be roughly about done. Right, so uh, what we're going to do now is just linseed oil it, then you can hang it up. Right, so what we're going to do is just clean it off like neutral, <laughs> clean it off with the wire brush, and it should look just beautiful. There you go, that's the cleaned up, so now all we've got to do is linseed oil it. That'll be it for this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Comment what you liked, what you didn't like. Like if you liked the video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Turn your turn notifications on so you do not miss out on any new videos. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you have a good day, good night, wherever you are, and bye-bye.